Josh P via email says, Hi, great web series. When does the cam chain on FSI need to be replaced? Same time as the belt? What are the symptoms of cam chain tensioner failure? Josh, the FSI, for anybody who's not familiar with what he's referring to, FSI engines have a timing belt that is on the passenger side of the engine, drives the camshafts, crankshafts, and, and uh, water pump. On the opposite side of the cylinder head, on the driver side, there is a cam chain that locks the two cams together and gives the vehicle the ability to adjust the cam uh, timing for uh, the timing adjustment for the ECM. Now, that does tend to have some issues over time, but there isn't really a service interval for that. It's something that you have to replace as needed and you're gonna have to maybe keep an eye on it. Mostly the best way to determine if you're having a problem is gonna be noise. They'll tend to start making chain slap noise when the little tensioner that it uh, keeps tension between it, either the guides break and you'll start hearing some chain slap or something like that. The adjuster units uh, also tend to fail sometimes. So it might be something you wanna keep, just pay attention to if you're having any timing related faults and you haven't recently done anything with the timing system, you could have a problem with the adjuster, the chain tensioner, or potentially the chain itself. So just keep an eye on that stuff. Thank you for watching episode 10 of the Ask Dap Show. If you want your questions answered, shoot us an email, info at shopdap.com.